So, Uncle Vanya, you've got drunk with the doctor again. You're becoming drinking companions. Well, he's always been like that, but why do you have to be? It's most unfitting at your age. Age doesn't come into it where there's no real life. People live on illusions. It's better than nothing. Oh, the hay laying moan in the fields, rain every day and everything rotting, and all you can think of is illusions. You've given up on the estate work entirely. I do it all on my own. I'm absolutely worn out. Tears in your eyes. Tears? What tears? Nonsense. You looked at me just then like your dear dead mother. Sweet. My sister. My sweet sister. Where is she now? No. If she had known. Oh, if she had known. What? Oh, known what? Uh, I think, well, I'm skirting around him, you know, coming in from different angles and uh, trying to get there. So I, suppose I will find him, yes. I'll, I'll twist and turn and shake him till I get something out of him. I would have thought Michael Gambon was, was born to play Uncle Vanya. Um, it really is the ideal cast. It's taken us a very long time to set it up and to cast it. And um, it's not attraction at the box office which has moved us. It is, it is suitability. I once did a production of a Chekhov play and I said to the cast, you ought to regard the characters you play as you do your very best friends. That is with affection, with great interest and with absolutely no mercy. If you'd told me this a month or two ago, I might have given it some thought. But now. Still, if Sonia finds the situation painful, then, naturally. There's just one thing I don't understand, and that is why you needed this cross-examination. You're a sly one. I don't know what you mean. You're being sly. All right, so Sonia finds it painful. That I can understand, but... What is the point of this cross-examination? Come on now. Don't put on your surprised face. You know perfectly well why I come here. Why I come here and who I come to see. You know that perfectly well, my little sparrow hawk. I've been swooped upon before. But for a whole month now, I've done nothing. I've let it all go and come thirsting after you. You find that terribly pleasing. So... I mean, you hope that it, 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 you were not performing a sort of museum piece, so that it does have a contemporary feel to it. Um, so that it doesn't go over people's heads and they can hear modern nuances occasionally, so that uh, they get clues as to what they should be thinking. You know. And the dialogue at first might seem quite straightforward, quite uh, um, obvious, but gradually the more you work on it, the more you rehearse and you try out different things, you find that um, in the most subtle ways, the, the words are indicating big clues to the character, and the characters are there. They're not there to invent. They're there to discover, like a kind of archaeological dig. I think, I think I've always, I think I've always felt lucky to be working at all, you know. And my, my first job was at the old Vic with Sir Lawrence, which was, uh, to me, like a dream. And it's been good ever since. I've always felt, uh, you know, uh, covered in luck and good fortune. But well, we must go and meet him. Hmm? No, have pity on me. Leave me be. No. You come to the forest tomorrow about two, all right? All right, will you? Will you? Let me go! Oh, this is appalling. Very passable weather today, my dear sir. It's overcast this morning. It looked like rain still. Sun's out now, having a very fair autumn, it must in all honesty be said. Winter crops are coming along. Only thing is, the days are drawing in. You must use all your influence, you must do everything you can to see that my husband and I are away from here today. You understand? Today. Oh, right. I saw the whole thing, Alain. You understand? I must be away from this place today.
Yeah, I, I'd, I'd like to play Othello. And there were, I think, discussions going on about yeah, that. Yeah, I've done it myself once, and I've been in other people's Othello, so I know it well. I know the lines, so it would be quite easy to rehearse, you know. <laughs> 